Hey everybody, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use ChatGPT to generate configuration scripts for you. So the other day, I had to create a ton of VXLAN tunnels on a FortiGate, and I didn't feel like having to manually go into like Notepad++ or something and adding all these interfaces manually. So I had the idea to create two or three and then ask ChatGPT to continue the sequence of the config script because I was just doing like VXLAN 10 through 75. In that case, everything that was unique, I just asked it to continue the pattern. So if I did VLANs 2, then 3, then 4, with VN, I, 2, 3, and 4, it knew to follow that pattern. Like you can see in the example here, with the end of my VXLAN script. And I wanted to do a video for this because I know back when I used to do a bunch of Cisco configurations that it was pretty common for me to have to do configurations with like hundreds of VLANs. And it just would have saved me a lot of time. So I wanted to share with you so that maybe this can help you to create your configuration scripts consistently and quickly. So how I was able to accomplish this was by pasting in a sample script. So here I have VLANs 10, 11, and 12, where I'm just giving them an IP address and then my helper address for relaying DHCP. And so I'm going to put this script in and I'm going to say at the top, please continue creating VLAN interfaces to follow this pattern. Do all the way up to, I'll just do like 50 or something. All right, I'll hit enter and we'll see what happens. And it didn't even have to think about it. <laughs> Just like that, bam. So I'm aware that you can use Excel for doing stuff like this. You can use Excel macros. I was never really good at that kind of stuff. And I used to try to find ways to do stuff like this all the time with find and replace trickery or whatever and variables. But you can't get much easier than that. So... I'm sure you'll think of other ways you could leverage the same chat GPT question to create other configuration scripts. I would love to hear about ones that you think about. So please post in the comments of how you think you can use this to save yourself some time. As always, thank you for watching the video. Please like and subscribe. I would appreciate it. And I will catch you in the next video tutorial.